time in YouTube and welcome back to episode 35 of the Pokemon Moon Let's Play. Today we are going to continue on with the Aether Paradise Breakin, um, because they took Lily and Cosmog and I don't know what they're up to but I have a funny suspicion it's not good. So without any further ado though, let's do a quick team recap and then that way we can know who we're working with, what we've got, and where we're going. So, any further ado... Uh, we're going to start ourselves off with Alana, our pre-marina, level 45, rocking aqua jet, sparkling area, psychic, and moon blast. It's also got leftovers to make it just a little bit more bulky. Uh, Speedy, our Alolan Raichu, still excited, that's electric, psychic, rocket, it's level 44, rocking thundershock, I wish it was more than that. Uh, psychic, nasty plot, and thunder wave, got the soothe bell to make it more friendly. Uh, we've got Carmen, our Salazzle, level 44, rocking Flame Thrower, uh, Nasty Plot, Sludge Bomb, Toxic, still holding the charcoal to power up that Flame Thrower. Uh, Soul, our Lorantis is level 43, rocking Leech Life, Leaf Blade, Petal Blizzard, and Swords Dance, rocking the Amulet Coin because if he's not collecting souls, he's collecting the dough. And we've got Sam. R2 Cannon, level 45, rocking Flame Charge, Beak Blast, Steel Wing, and. Br Brick Break. Rocking the Sharp Beak to power up that Beak Blast. And lastly, we have Lupin, our Lycan Rock, Rockin' Stealth Rocks, Rock Slide, Counter, and Crunch, holding the Hard Charm to power up that Rock Slide. So without any further ado, let's get to this team motoring. We're going on to floor number two. Good thing we didn't go here because we would have initiated the cutscene like right away. Just as a thought. Whoa, that was like a cross in between the two. I don't know if you guys can hear my voice changes at all. I apologize if my voicing is terrible, but that unfortunately is how my voice is. I hear it in my head how many different voices I've got, but I've, I've listened to myself after the recording. It's like, they all sound the same. But anyway, what were you doing there? Looks like I, outsiders can't use the main elevator to reach the lower levels. I was afraid this might happen, but still, what a pain. We don't have any choice, we'll have to go up. We're going up, you say, eh? Up! I, Faba, am the Aether Branch Chief. The only one in the world I'm irreplaceable. And here you come back, uninvited. Like you don't know why. You of all people should know everything that happens in the Aether Foundation. Isn't that right, High and Mighty Branch Chief? <laughs> Look at you. Living out in the world hasn't been kind, has it? But I'm still not telling you anything, and you of all people should understand why, Gladian. Hey, time. You know why being a trainer is so great? Because when you're battling, it doesn't matter if you're a kid or an adult. Everyone's equal in Pokemon battle. Oh, ho is that right? Is that what you think? So you wish to battle me, Branch Chief Faba. The man is the man who is called Aether Paradise's last line of defense is to battle a mere child. As you win. I'm not threatened. And something tells me I I no, I have not looked at any teams or anything. Something tells me he's got Dewpider, because it looks like Dewpider is based around him. It just, it does. It looks like a, he ha looks like he has Dewpider. Or uh, a Raquinod. He's got a Hypno. Okay, I'm wrong. I'm sorry. He's got a Hypno. Just one Pokemon. One Pokemon. That's all he's got. It's not really that intimidating, actually. Uh, we're going to go with a... Stab Moonblast. Goodbye, Hypno. Okay, half Hypno. Special attack drops, goes for the hypnosis. Oh, are we playing these games again? I don't like playing these games, it's not fun. Uh, we're not going for the fight, we're going for the... Nope, not the Pokemon either, we're just going for the bag, we're going for that Awakening! I clicked on the Awakening. Wake up. I might actually have to go to the Pokemon Center and buy some... Uh, Actually, I haven't been to a Pokemon Center to upgrade our stores in a while. I'm, I might be missing that. I've missed out on a lot of stuff. I feel like I've been 
not rushing, but I've been too into the game to really be looking too deep into like the stores and stuff. So we're gonna go take a look after everything is said and done, maybe. Mind you, we haven't really passed a. I don't know if we have. Rock climb? What is rock climb? It's a normal move. The user attacks the target by smashing it into it with the incredible force. Uh, no. Uh, no. Give up on this one. I don't need rock climb. Hey! We beat you, buddy. We beat you. How can this be? How could this mere child? Eh, uh, look at you, time. And Faba is real strong, too. So, as I said, Faba, you of all people know what I'm here for. Indeed. The world truly hasn't been kind to you, has it? Look how hard it has been has made you. If you're looking for Cosmog, I suppose it might be downstairs. Downstairs? Oh, sorry. Downstairs? Oh, yeah. Miss Wick did say there was another level farther down, didn't she? What do you do down there? Well, if you must know, I've heard experiments are held down there. Experiments aiming to tear the very boundaries of the world apart. We're in a bit of a hurry, Faba. A lift would be nice. Why not? This is an a this is an act of kindness I can do for you thanks to my position as branch chief. It's one of those can't take a kid on, so I gotta do what he says. Time. How? If you're ready, let's head down. Are you ready? I got nowhere else to go! Alright, let's go. I guess we could have walked around here, I guess, but... Um, we can. I can do all sorts of exploring on my own time. He knows something. Everything looks the same. I guess it's only been two years, though. Wow, it's like a secret hideout. Don't get too excited, Hal. Though I guess it's better than freezing from fear or nerves. So where do we go now? There are two labs ahead. I'll check the first lab, Secret Lab A. You two check out Secret Lab B. It's the second lab down the hall. Why do you get the first one? And why do you know all this? Just focus, Hal. Think you can do that? We can't trust Fava. I'm sure he's already, hold, already told half the Foundation all about us. You didn't even answer my question. I know what it's gotta be. Nerves, eh? I reckon that you're more afraid to be here than either one of us, huh, Gladian? Here, time. You take this. You're giving me a max revive for what? Lily must be scared right now. Let's buckle down and do this. Why are you giving me a max revive? It is not cool. It is not nice. We're gonna go down the hallway. I thought that pause was gonna be a little bit more, um, you know. Intruder spotted. We'll protect our secret labs. Our secret labs are not safe anymore. They'll be destroyed in a moment's notice. It's fine by me. It's fine by me. I just want out of here. You give us back our friend, we can go back on our trial, and we're all good to go. A muck. I can't actually stay in with you. Now don't get me wrong, we're what? Almost ten, we're almost ten levels of love. But we can't stay in. Uh, we're gonna go into Lupin. I still have no ground moves on my team. Like, period. Kinda hoping that uh, we can get Earthquake and Lupin can learn Earthquake, and that would just be, like, amazing. Um. We can go for the Rock Slide. Hope for a flinch. It flinched! Oh, that's awesome! Go for another. Oh no. 
Okay. Screech I'm okay with. Screech I'm okay with. Alright, we got this boys and girls. And everybody who's watching, we got this! Muck is down. Speedy is 45. It seems as though I may have lost. You have lost. You only had one Pokemon. I guess that's still the big problem. There are only researchers like us here in the secret labs. Looks like I'm next. I'll show you the power of Aether Paradise. We're gonna take on three people instead of doing this all in one scene. Three Pokemon, three people. That's really how this goes? If the Challenger employee sent out a magnet, we gotta get Leia out of there again. But at least we've got. Mm. I think I might take Leia, Leia, uh, Lana, Leia, Lana, out of the front. Cause she's just getting bodied by these Steel types, and Dark types, or not Dark, but Poison. Mirror shot. Well, we didn't hit you with anything, so it shouldn't do much. And it's not very effective, but our accuracy fell. We just go for the flamethrower. Still land it! That should that Magneton gets sturdy, eh? Metal sound. This also is resistant, I do believe. Special defense harshly falls. Uh, we go for the... I wonder. I know corrosion makes you get poison, but does it make steel type still affected by poison? I'll have to check that out, actually. It's an interesting thing. I haven't done enough development work on Pokemon battles. And we've got one more here in front of us. We're currently working on the development of a new Pokeball. It is apparently to be used to catch Pokemon not found in Alola. How about a guess what you're looking for? Cosmog, right? If you want to know what kinds of experiments we did with it, then you'll have to beat me. You are evil! Evil, I say! Evil! The Foundation member. Porygon 2. I did say I should get Lana out of there, but I didn't do it, and I'm not really in a bad position. Porygon 2 really needs the... It gets Torrent. Let's hit it with a Blast. I know Eve didn't properly train Porygon's really good, but it's not. It's got a Magnet Rise! Hey, That's not gonna help you right now, buddy. I'm not using Earthquake. I'd love to use Earthquake, but I don't have Earthquake. Down goes the Porygon 2. And that's another battle. Ooh, one. That time Lana could do it just fine. And it's almost 46. All I can tell you is that Cosmog is the key. It's the tool needed to open the Ultra Wormhole. But I'm no good at battling, so I'm out of here. Run! Run or walk. It's fine. It's fine. You're not in any urgency. That's lab number one. And this one's lab number two. What are you kids doing in here? Don't touch anything with your grimy hands. This research is our life. I don't care if you're a kid or what. I'll send you flying if you threaten it. Sorry, buddy, but you're going down. They look evil. She doesn't, but he looks evil. Vanillish and Machoke. He sends out his Raichu. 
Oh no. As long as you don't have discharge, I'm happy. I can take care of Machoke. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Electro Ball. I didn't even learn that! Okay, I'm taking care of Machoke. That poor guy just got demolished. Planet's 46. The rest of your team gets the XP share. Ice Beam. That's not good. Enough. Not to me, anyway. And I don't care if you get to Um. We can sparkling area. Uh, I might actually take out the Raichu, though. I forget that it hits everybody. But it's okay. His partner is not important to me. I took it out too. Whoops. I'm a good partner. E. But we beat them. It's not a particularly original line, but wherever the area is light, there is also shadow. There's another world that cannot be brought about through idle talk. Got it? I got it. I may be an expert at studying Pokemon, but I'm no expert when it comes to battling them. But the guys in Lab A next door, they're pretty experienced with battles. After all, they spent so long researching that uncontrollable Pokemon. Hey, focus! Er, hey, focus! People, where are Lily and Cosmog? We may have lost, but that doesn't mean we're going to help you. I'm not telling you anything. She's not here, is she? Even you can see that. Come on, time. Let's split up and look around. Maybe we'll find some clue. It's gonna be in the room. Or not. I lied. Beyond the ultra wormholes that Professor Moan discovered lies a different dimension. By investigating the changes in mass there, we can predict the existence of Pokemon-like life. We have dubbed them Ultra Beasts for now. Do -do -do -do. Cosmog is hyper hypothesized to be a type of ultra beast that hails from another dimension, a dimension that we have named Ultra Space. When placed under sufficient stress, it reveals it reveals the power to create and open ultra wormholes in order to escape from its suffering. We are now working on a device that will allow us to manipulate the ultra wormholes created when Cosmog is subjected to extreme stress. Wait, so Cosmog might be an ultra beast? We should tell Gladian about this. Alright, so we got our clue. Go to lab number one. Do we really need a cutscene here? Did you find anything? We learned a bit about Cosmog. Like, it might be an Ultra Beast or whatever, and if you stress it a lot, it can create Ultra Wormholes, maybe to run away or something. If you stress it, if you hurt it, is that what you mean? Was that why she ran away with it? We didn't find any sign of it down here. Yeah, Faber probably knew this would be a dead end. Darn. Did he outsmart us? To the top! Gladiator never really explains anything, eh? Probably thinks it might be it might it makes him look cool. Should we go after him? We all got into this together. Might as well see it to the end together. Well, I first off want the Zygarde thing. Thank you. Come on. So we're going all the way back up where we should have gone the first place. We should have gone the first place. But alas, we do not. Oh, I went to the wrong floor. I bet you I went to the wrong floor. I clicked on too many buttons, hit the wrong thing. Time. What time? <clears throat> Even beating down old Faba doesn't change, does he? What do we do? Beat whoever stands in our way. What other choice do we have? Fine, fine. We can do that. But do you have to say hmm? all the time? Hello, children. I'm afraid Branch Chief Faba has given us orders regarding you three. Now that you've learned of the darkness at the heart of Aether Paradise, we'll need you all to conveniently disappear. 
Whoa, time. Battle with me. We'll take on these guys, and then we won't disappear. It's funny, you know, some of these guys probably are a lot, a lot older than us, and at the age of 11, you start your your trials. As, like, to, like, to mature. I'll shut up now, because they all have pretty good Pokemon. Raichu's not going to help. Raichu, if you can take out the Pelipper, that would be great. I'm going to hit Sparkling Area and deal damage to all three. Hit the Pelipper! Hit the Pelipper! Alright, Pelipper's going down. I might take out Raichu again, buddy. Just saying! Sparkling Area, I am way higher level than this. And down goes the Mudstep. The Raichu lived. Good to know. But when I battle how again, can't use Sparkling Area against it. You guys are dazzling, horribly sparkling. The children of Alola who aim to be champion through the Island Challenge, they are not to be underestimated. Yeah, we're, we're good. We battle all day long. You think that we're not good? Ridiculous. Have the children of Alola always been this strong? That's what you get when you go through the trials of the Island Challenge. Now that you understand, how about you get out of our way? Phew. Thanks, Time and Primarian. Uh, Primarina? When you're fighting a battle you can't afford to lose, you really can't waver at all, huh? Let's go. You know, I know what we aren't friends, but I'm glad you two are here. I remember what you said at Battle Royal Dome that day, how? About how people can achieve more if they do something together. Looks like maybe you were right. He's a good kid. He's not a rival in any way. Young Master. I was like, what do you mean, young master? It has been a long time. And hello to you two, Time and How. Please allow me to heal your Pokemon. Oh, you are still a nice lady! What's happened to Lady? Uh, what's happened to Lily? Do you know anything? I, I imagine that she is with the president. And that's where I'm going. That's all I need to know. The president? That's, Luzami that's Miss Luzamine, right? She's a really nice person, so I'm sure she'll listen to us if we explain everything. Yeah, she's real nice, as long as you mean nothing to her. But I'm afraid the doors have been locked. Again? That's not stopping me. So apparently this lady is really nice and everybody else in this place is really mean. Typical. And Faba wants another boat. My, my, what naughty children. You should lay your heavy heads down. But I knew that you would struggle onward. I could see through every action you would take. So I knew you would try to reach the president. And that is why I knew that I would be able to ambush you here and remedy my previous failure. The only reason I let you in the lower floor was to buy time to gather more staff to stop you. So, uh, Mr. Fama, do you have the key to the president's room? Indeed, I have it right here. So if you just so if you just stay hidden, we would have been stuck here anyway, right? What? E enough, you lot. Teach these children a lesson. We don't have time for this. Help me out here, time. You got it. You got it, boss. You're the boss. I'm the kid. I do the grunt work, you do the thinking. I got it. The employees have come to battle. Magmar and Electabuzz. It's a good duo. You're not Magmar and Electifier, though. I don't know if this is a good idea, but I'm going to hit you with a sparkling arrow. I want to see Type Null on my side. Uh, 
I almost took out the Electabuzz. That's a strong attack. Sends an Electro Ball. Who's he hitting? Goes for the gold bat. I don't care. I'm good. He'll go into Type Null now, and we're all good. Type Null's only 39. Now we can go for a Moonblast against the Electabuzz. And Electabuzz will go down sooner. Gone. Now that probably would not have taken it out for the same level. But that is why we are higher. Carmen's level 45. Sam is level 46. Guess it's back to honest Pokemon conservation activities for me. Losing to you generated dark feelings in me. Sorry guys, but that's just how it works. We're the number one team. How can this be to, mere co to be cornered by mere children? Maybe helping one another out isn't so bad. Time, how? I leave Faba to you. Uh, enough! I will show you the true power of Branch Chief Faba, the man who is called Aether Paradise's last line of defense. We will settle this at last with a multi-battle. Come on, Time. Let's show him just what our Pokemon are capable of. For Lily and for Cosmoc, too. Okay. Multi battles. A multi battle. Branch Chief Faba and an employee. Faba's up to three Pokemon though. At least he's got something different. Slowbro and Lydia. How sends it the Raichu? I actually think I think I should come in here as Sam. Because if the Raichu can take out the slope, well it's not gonna take out the slope. But if he can do some massive damage to Slowbro, then we're in good business. Goes for the Psychic on the Slowbro. Why wouldn't you... You're stupid. You're stupid. You get the special defense drop, that's fine. They put up a light screen. It's not great. And... Yawn on... Raichu. Okay, I am good with that. You can be all the sleepy you want. I'm gonna go for a Flame Charge on the Ledian. So speed us up a bit. Let's go for the electric ball on. You're not really doing a good job here, buddy. I'm surprised this Ledian's actually a speeding too. Uh, a speeding. But that is why we have flame charge to get people faster. And down goes the Ledian. Up goes our speed. Exactly what we want. Sam is doing a fantastic job. With the grid to level 46, and Slowbro goes for a headbutt. They're picking on Raichu, that is for sure. Question is, what is How going to do for this poor Raichu? I'm going to beat Blast. Raichu just stays in, he's asleep. Yawn on me. Shame on you. Beak Blast, do the damage, do- Ooh. I see we are in trouble. I'm gonna go out into my speedy. Unfortunately, I don't have Electro Ball. Yours goes to sleep. Psychic on me, that's not gonna do much, but speedy's actual special defense isn't that great. I gotta go for the Thunder Shock. Cause it's all I've got. Still doesn't take it out. Raichu wakes up, goes for a second. 
Stop going for Psychic! It's a water type! At least it's gone. At least it's gone. Slowbro is always a problem. Speedy's level 46. Lana's 47! Light screen wears off. Rook's... Well, it's kind of good that we both have our IQ still. Um... Go for the Thundershock on the Bruxish. And it's pretty much down. Why are you going for Psychic? It's living because you're not going for Electro Ball. And he's got Crunch. Speedy's gone. He's never going to make it as a Kahuna. If he keeps going for Psychic when he has Stab Electrical Powers. It's a quick attack. Is that really what you want to go for, buddy? Soul got to level 45. I missed there, and out comes him. Uh, we're gonna go for a leech life, which will take care of this guy, no problem. And now you go for Electro Ball! You make no sense. You make no sense. Psychic on the grass. Good call. At least you know what you're doing. And... BAM! You're... Oh my... Why are they living on, like, one? Um, each life again, because I know he's just going to go for a, he goes for a electrical He's a smart trainer. I, I like you, How I really do, but I cannot express how stupid you are. How stupid you are. You are stupid, 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 stupid. I want to help save Lily, so go on ahead. You don't mind, right? Thanks for the key, Mr. Fava. He's so mad. This is why. This is why I can't bring myself to like children. It's because you're not a very good person. Um, we are going to end it today right here, right before the final events of Aether Paradise. Will we save Lily in the next episode? Who knows? You guys will have to tune in to find out. So with that, with that thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. But until then, time 